This is Rhea with Westman Homes. Today we're going to be looking at the San Cristobal in Las Arboledas. This home features four bedrooms, two and a half baths, and a two car garage. The great thing about this home is it's open concept that flows smoothly from the living, the dining, as well as the kitchen. With this particular home, it is going to have a nine foot plate, which is going to give it a more open, spacious, luxurious feel to it. Let's check it out, guys. Hey guys, before we go into the San Cristobal here in Las Arboledas, just wanted to give you a little rundown of the standards. The standard here is going to be the one brick with the three siding sides of the hardy backer. Now, you do also have the option to upgrade to the three side brick or the four side brick. Now, the color palette out here is going to be the antique gray with the trim, the fascia soffit in the shadow gray. Let's take a look inside, it's a little hot out here. As soon as you walk in, you will notice your stairs off to your left. Of course, the high ceilings and as well as the window right behind me lets in plenty of sunlight to help your guests visualize the wonderful open concept that this home offers. Let's take a look at the dining as well as the kitchen. This open concept definitely flows really nicely from the living to the dining and as well, of course, the kitchen. If you'll notice here in the dining, it has plenty of space for a large table and of course, six guests. If you continue, of course, here in the kitchen, you have your Luna Perla granite countertop, which is a level one upgrade, as well as your pendant lights, which are gonna be the wind gate. So aside from the pendant light upgrade, you do have a few other upgrades within the San Cristobal. One of my favorites is going to be the pantry door, as well as the fog white cabinets in the shaker style, and of course, Another one of my favorites is gonna be the gooseneck. Now with the gooseneck, you do have the option of having that in the satin nickel or the oil rub, oil rub bronze, but again, that is going to be an upgrade. Another wonderful upgrade within the kitchen is going to be your wine rack above your fridge. That's a really nice feature that also houses uh, liquor bottles. Now moving on into the breakfast area. This is an area that you have as well, apart from your dining and apart from your actual peninsula where you and your guests can uh, have your meal. Now, I've showed you the living space as well as the kitchen and your third dining option. Let's take a look at the spacious master. One of the great features about the San Cristobal is that the master is actually on the first floor, so you don't have to worry about going up and down the stairs to get to your bedroom. Now, one feature that I really like about this particular home is if you will notice the nine foot ceiling height, it does give you a more spacious feel throughout the home on the first floor. Now another upgrade within this master is going to be the four recess cans. Now those, are, again, are an upgrade, but it is an option. Let's take a look at your master bath. Welcome to the master bath. One of the features that does transfer over from the kitchen are going to be the level one granite, which is in the Luna Perla, as well as the fog white cabinets in the shaker style. The standard feature for the San Cristobal in Homestead is the fiberglass tub. With this home, we went ahead and upgraded it to the garden tub, and of course, it's in tandem with the walk-in shower with the 13 by 13 Riviera gray tile. Thank you so much for taking this tour with me today of the San Cristobal in Las Arboledas. Please stay tuned for our future videos, and also check out our website, westwindhomes.com, for our inventory. Have a lovely day.